Hello and welcome to another episode of Speakeasy Cocktails, where I teach you how to make some of the best cocktails that history's forgot. I'm your host, Joe the Bartender, and today I'm going to teach you all about the 20th century cocktail. Gin, lemons, and chocolate might dissuade most people from trying this cocktail, which is a real shame, as it's one of the most refreshing Prohibition-era cocktails I've ever come across. Packing a strong lemonade tartness in front and a noticeable chocolate finish, this cocktail is a delicious treat any time of the year, especially during the summer. When describing this cocktail, Ted Haig, AKA Dr. Cocktail said, I believe we now have a firm idea of exactly what Art Deco tastes like. And I couldn't agree more. This cocktail first appeared in the 1937 Cafe Royale cocktail book and is credited to bartender C.A. Tuck. The Cafe Royale bar book was the unofficial recipe guide used by the United Kingdom Bartenders Guild. This cocktail is but one of many that display the versatility and creativity of the guild. Tuck created this recipe in honor of the 20th Century Limited Train, which had just announced its new steamlined futuristic designs for its trains to be debuted the same year as the cocktail. Because of this, the cocktail quickly became a staple on that train and in many bars and nightclubs in the area surrounding the train stations. To make this cocktail, you're going to need the following things. Gin. No specification here, so grab whatever your favorite gin is. Kina Lele, currently known as Lilit Blanc, but it is still available. Creme de Cacao. Light is called for in the recipe, but if you only have dark, it will work as well, seeing as they have the same flavor. Lemon juice. As always, fresh squeezed is best. And lastly, a lemon for garnish. The beautiful thing about this drink is it's really easy to make. So all you gotta do is fill your cocktail shaker three-fourths of the way full with ice, and then pick out your favorite gin and use an ounce and a half. Go ahead and toss that in the shaker. Next up, three-fourths of an ounce of Kina Lele and three-fourths an ounce of lemon juice. Finally, top that off with half an ounce of creme de cacao, and you're all set. Now, you'll notice there's a lot of lemon flavoring in the drink and not a whole lot of chocolate, but they balance really well. Next, you just want to shake it till it's nice and cold, and then strain it into a cocktail glass. And lastly, you want to garnish it with a lemon twist. And there you have it, the 20th century cocktail. Until next time, I'm your host, Joe the Bartender, and I'll see you in the speakeasies.